at least you will look the part in this fit, okay? In this look, you will look the part, okay? Period. Yes, it's giving everything. Hi, guys. It's so good to see your beautiful face. For those of you who don't know, my name is Megan and I am a fashion and lifestyle YouTuber. Welcome to my channel. And today we're gonna to be talking about how to style like Phoebe Philo. I am a working girly slash, well, right now I'm an employed girly. <laughs> But um, this is out of my price point, like many of you. And so I wanted to create and pull looks that are affordable and that still give you that elevated look, um, similar to the Phoebe Philo um, lookbook. Okay guys, the first look is the hand embroidered coat. And when I initially saw this, I was like, period. I said, let me gather myself because I almost fell off my stool, guys. Like when I saw, I just love, I'm a coat gal. And so this coat was everything that I didn't know I needed. And so one of the great things about this coat, I really like the dimensions and how it's so puffy and oversized and exaggerated. Um, and I, this A looks so warm. I know that model is warm. And it's giving Chewbacca in runway. It's giving Chewbacca in high fashion. You feel me? Like it's giving. And I really like how just like shaggy it is. And this is quite up my alley. I'm just like a more is more type gal and in some instances in this instance in this case i think it's fabulous so it's estimated retail is twenty five thousand dollars and it's not quite at my budget um but there's other alternatives like this jacket from H&M. This jacket from H&M i really love how the shoulder um and this is in fuzzy jacket in cream and this all white it would look fantastic and elevated look or you can definitely style this if you're going out on then on town um and with black this is a great coat and i like the dimensions of the shoulders that adds and gives more of a point of interest than just a shaggy coat and uh, makes you look like a muppet so this definitely is giving i'm like come on period h&m and this is retail for 259 dollars which is right up my alley the next coat is the Stargazer coat from Free People, and you can also find it on Revolt as well. This coat, I really, what I like about it is it's a little bit more casual. This would be really great for if you're, um, you can pair this with denim or you can pair this with the maxi dress. I think this would be fabulous. It's a really, it looks very cozy, fuzzy. Um, it's giving more of that bohemian look, but I do still like the color because it's more casual and you can wear it um, around the town or if you're wearing errands and like a denim jumpsuit, I can totally en envision that. That's super chic to me. Um, and it comes in different colors if maybe the ivory isn't quite calling your name but i do like the the base of this coat because it gives you again that texture that point of interest and it's it just you'll be fabulous if somebody walked in the room in either of these coats i'd be like ah, ah, who is she so next up we have the men's coat and i really like the shape of this coat it's giving powerhouse it's giving on the box it's giving it's just giving that ceo energy and so i really like this look it's very consistent with what we've been seeing on runways and with the minimalist trends and the quiet luxury this will give you that elevated look very cheap timeless and a great investment piece that you'll have in your wardrobe for a while more for my price point and so one of which is from Frankie's Shop. And this one's a little bit more pricier, but it still gives you that elevated shoulder that is very similar to Phoebe Philo's man's coat. This will give you that dimension, that structure that you need. Also really great other options from Mango, which is a wool coat and it is retails at $199. Doesn't have quite the dimensions in the shoulder, but it still gives you that oversized, timeless look. And then last but not least, we have 
from H&M, which I actually own this coat, guys, and it is fabulous. I get so many compliments on this coat, but this coat is um, in black or the tan, and this gives you, again, that oversized look before an affordable price of $99. So this is a really great coat. Like I said, you'll have it in your wardrobe, and this is a piece that you can interchange with um, an oversized white shirt and oversized or wide leg pants. So that would still look fabulous and give you that elevated edge and you can pair it with some sneakers. Next we have the cargo jacket and the cargo look, guys. I'm excited for cargos. I know some people are like, eh, but I'm like, yes, uh, come on cargos, let's go. It gives Survivor on, give Survivor, I'm not gonna stop, uh, I'm not, uh, 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 it is that, okay? And it just, I really like how cargos are coming back in style. I used to have some pink cargos when I was younger and I just, it, I was giving, I was serving even as a child in my cargos. I feel like cargos look really great on so many different body types and it just adds some interest to the wardrobe. And also it's functional. It's like design that's functional with the different pockets because like who wants to carry a purse when you like, just have to go run an errand, not me, not me. And also pairing it with this and other, other stories coat. I think this coat would, it's not over too oversized where it swallows um, people, but I feel like it still has that shape that gives you that femininity um, and still like softness. Speaking of cargos, the fourth look that I really loved and that I think is practical, easy to pull off is this look with paired with the sweater. But what I really like about this is the styling, how it's paired with loafers. I think that's super interesting. It's Reformation lovers. They're really cool. They give you that platform, that elevation, but still very classic and you can rewear them and have them in your wardrobe for quite some time. Let me know if you end up trying any of these looks and which one was your favorite. Comment below and don't forget to like and subscribe. So I love you guys. Bye.